Every time the Olympics roll around, we get to see the dazzling spectacle of women's gymnastics. And luckily for us, the fun doesn't stop there. We don't have to wait for four years to experience this incredible sport at the highest level. Yup, there are world championships, as well as the stacked NCAA championships every single year. That's right, we're going to be talking about some of the amazing athletes who compete in these competitions. First up, Shailene Jones is stronger than ever. She's had a tough time recently, and not even she could have expected to reach the heights that she did in 2022. We mean it guys, it's easy to look at her dominant performance in 2022 and forget what she's had to go through to get here. To think about it, she had to overcome loss and failure that most people wouldn't be able to handle. We mean she missed out on the Tokyo Olympics by just one spot, and you know that's soul crushing for an athlete who's been working to compete at the elite level all their life. Things only got worse though. She also lost her beloved father, who was there for her throughout her years of training to a kidney disease. It's heavy stuff guys, and we wouldn't be surprised if she chose to never compete again. But hey, you can never count these athletes out. They're cut from a different cloth, and all their lives are built on hard work and dedication. No matter how hard it was, we're glad Jones returned in 2022. She was unstoppable, and not only did she win silver at the Worlds, she also seems to have newfound confidence and is reaching levels we haven't seen from her before. We're sure you guys were also moved by her words at the end of all of this struggle. That's right, Shailice. We all agree that you're a force to be reckoned with. And honestly, guys, with the year she's had, no one can deny it. Next up, Jones's goal for 2024. We all felt the pain for this athlete when she performed so well in 2020 and still missed out on every sports person's dream. We're talking about the Olympics. She was on the pace to be chosen as the replacement gymnast for the US team. Unfortunately, it wasn't meant to be, and she missed out by one spot. Yeah, we know. That's enough to crush anyone. But guys, she's turned it all around in 2022. Talk about perseverance. She silenced all the doubters this year when she won the silver medal at the Worlds and helped the US win their sixth straight global team's title. Needless to say, she's given given us a lot of entertainment this last year. But she didn't just stop with the silver medal. No, she declared her goal for 2024 and the fans loved it. That's right guys, Jones is gonna try for another run at the Olympics. And if things work out, which based on her performance, it looks like they will, then we're gonna see this new star of the US gymnastics team in Paris. Who knows, maybe we're about to see another Biles level phenom burst onto the scene. Following up, just stay normal. All right, we just compared Jones to the legendary Simone Biles, and we're sure you guys want to head to the comments. But guys, this athlete is genuinely special, and she's just starting her freshman year. Honestly, if she keeps going at the pace she set this year, we might just see another legendary US-based gymnast. But you might be wondering, what suddenly changed? Well, we're sure you've experienced it too, guys. But sometimes, just a push in the right direction can help you improve to levels you never thought you could achieve. That's right, other than just enduring the loss of her father, her coaches also helped shape her into the absolute beast she's become. It's not like she suddenly became special. No, she was always special. Now, she's just owning it, and we love to see it. Her confidence has gone up, and her coaches explain how they've helped her realize that she doesn't need to try to be special. She is special, so she just needs to relax and stay normal. And she She's been doing just that. She didn't win silver at Liverpool for nothing. Like she said, she's a force to be reckoned with, and now she realizes it. This silver medal was a huge win. Just by the way, she beat established members of the US Olympic team, including Jade Carey. That's right, it's a huge deal. Even if Carey wasn't involved, winning an elite level medal in gymnastics is something that counts if you're thinking of going to the Olympics. Next up, Shailisa's upcoming freshman year. The 20 year old Jones is heading to her freshman year, and you can bet she's gonna want to get involved with collegiate gymnastics. Yup, this National Collegiate Athletic Association awaits, and people always talk about how winning at the college level is easier than the elite world level competitions, but 
The NCAA is no joke, guys. Honestly, the college-level gymnastics scene in the USA is stacked with Olympic-level talent. You can bet we love to see these top athletes compete and even carve a path for themselves to represent the US in international competitions. Needless to say, the NCAA title is no joke, and winning on the national level in the US means you're an elite athlete that stands at the top of all the others in America, a powerhouse of international gymnastics. The finals last year were in April. That's right, we've had to wait patiently this whole last year for the 2023 season. Let's take a look at some of the athletes to watch out for this year. And let's talk about where that NCAA title might end up at the end of the 2023 season. Let's get into it. First up, Jade Carey. All right, we all knew this one had to be on the list. Carey's undeniably one of the greatest gymnastic talents in the world right now. And she's for sure one of the best the US has to offer. Luckily for us, this Olympic gold medalist is also still studying. We get to see this star compete at the collegiate level. Honestly, it's hard to say who will take the 2023 championship. And granted, Carrie didn't win in 2022, but she's still shown. The athlete achieved a career best and dominated at the state level. Sure, but she also won fourth place in the collegiate level all around championship. Now in her sophomore year, we might just see her pull through and win gold for Oregon. With the level of coaching and her level of skill, it's a very real possibility. Next up, Suni Lee. This is another name everyone was probably expecting. Yup, Jade isn't the only Olympian on this list. Suni is another of the best US athletes, and she proved herself on the world stage when she won the all-around gold medal at the Tokyo Olympics. She didn't just stop there though, and won silver in the women's team final, and even snagged a bronze in the individual uneven bars. Yeah, she's a world-class athlete, but what about her record at the collegiate level? If you expected greatness, well, you were right, because not only did Lee play second in the 2022 NCAA All-Around Championship, but she also won gold on the balance beam. It wouldn't be an exaggeration to say that she carried Auburn to a fourth place ranking overall. Yeah, we're willing to bet Lee is going hard training for the 2023 season. We're sure she's going to want to get that first place this time. Following up, Jordan Childs. Yeah, this list is packed with Olympians, and that should tell you just how competitive the NCAA is. Childs is another member of the US gymnastics team along with Lee and Kerry, and she might shake things up and steal this year's all-around title right from under her teammates. Just like Shailise, Childs was there competing in Liverpool. That's right, she not only has represented the US in the Olympics and brought home a silver medal, but she also won medals at Liverpool in 2022. She's had a great year, and if she keeps up her performance, she's going to be in the running for the College Athletic Association all-around title. Coming up, Emily Morgan and Grace McCallum. All right, more Olympians. These two won team medals with the UK and US, respectively, and are definitely in the top contenders for the 2023 NCAA season. We can't be sure of anything, guys. All of these athletes are incredible, and we don't know who might show us something new. One thing's for sure, though, we'd be fools to ignore Morgan and McCallum. These two have been consistently performing for their teams and have been placing pretty well. Finally, Trinity Thomas. Once again, you guys probably knew this was coming sooner or later. Yup, the athlete is probably the most likely to win the 2023 title. You heard us. No matter how many Olympians, Olympic medals, or world title winners there are on this list, this non-Olympian absolutely dominated and swept the 2022 NCAA championship. Not only did she win on the uneven bars and the floor, but she she also took home the coveted gold in the all-around category. Talk about an undisputed winner. We're sure Florida's thanking their lucky stars that this once-in-a-generation talent ended up with them. Following up, her record at the college level. We can't doubt Trinity, guys. She's a four-time U.S. national team member, and on top of that, she's won the NCAA title three times. Those are some insane numbers. And sure, she hasn't won medals at the Olympic level, but don't be fooled, guys. This is an athlete that has represented the US on the national stage. We mean she was part of the gold medal winning team at the Pan American Gymnastics Championships. This 2023 season's looking good for Thomas, and her dominance can genuinely be compared to Simone's. Yup, no matter who she's up against, with the performance she's been displaying, the 2023 NCAA title is Trinity's to lose. But hey, just because she's probably got a great chance doesn't mean you can count out 
about any of the others on this list, especially Suni Lee. We mean Trinity won 2022, sure, but she barely edged out the win over Lee. Both athletes were near perfect. And don't count out Kerry, Charles, Morgan, or McCallum either. Anything could happen, and all of these athletes are special. That's it for this one, guys. Who do you think will be the winner of the NCAA 2023 championships? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. And as always, like and subscribe. See you guys in the next one.